niggas is garbage. Shh. All of you niggas is garbage. Shh. Baby, you cool driving retarded. I got that gas on me, smell like you farted. You yeah. Told that boy, don't get me started. I'm flexing, I feel like Bob Marley. Whole lot of gang shit. Great job, team. Uh, welcome back, everyone. Welcome back. What's good, e? Awkward hug. Uh, we appreciate everyone uh, joining. As always, subscribe to the fucking Patreon. Patreon.com. Thank you. <laughs> Over my Crocs. <laughs> it's, <No. it's> still <laughs> A lot of wires going on right Patreon. here. Patreon.com slash awkward hug. Uh, please go subscribe so we can leave this corporate nightmare that we live. Here. Uh, this is episode 11. We were off last week, not by our own volition. We've been trying to keep steady uh to the course keep uploading i just had guys. diarrhea so we like <laughs> could not drop it there was a lot of things going on imagine we were like so sorry everyone moses was pooping a lot i was so. taking a shit <laughs> <laughs> we're out of uh, toilet paper we couldn't record so we just put it off yeah it was a tough week for him do we do we want to say why no or, we do not no okay well maybe we'll drop it on the patreon <laughs> yeah. it was through no fault of our own we'll just say that yeah no fault of our own because the boys are fucking dedicated and we're it. pushing on so we're pushing on we're moving forward um man i really forgot that i was wearing crocs before i was good. this is the first time i've like worn shoes in this place i actually feel more of a person right yeah now. i don't like when i'm sitting on here and people can see the bottom of my feet yeah my YouTube dirty ass channel. socks yeah i don't like yeah. that uh, so yeah, we're back uh, with the boys. We have no guests this week. It's a boys only episode. Amigos uh, only. So you We've know we got Zach and Stu. We got producer Zach in the stew. Yeah, I believe. I believe permanent producer. Permanent producer Zach. Let's go, everyone. That's round of, round everyone of applause. Round of applause for permanent yeah. producer Zach. Say hello. Zach, Thanks for having me, guys. Us. We Let's love go. having you here. Yeah. Thanks for helping us out. If you're listening on the subway, clap it up. Yeah. If you're at home, clap it up. Let's salute. go. Salute. If you see any policemen, salute. <laughs> <laughs> Unrelated this, to the no, Zach. This is a cab podcast. Now that I'm producing. This is an ACAP pod. Uh, I've been uh, doing that. Just like you what, just saluting, just cops? saluting cops. They feel so uncomfortable. It's awesome. As they should. Why are you a cop? We were at the <laughs> we were at the I was at a wedding this weekend and I the first thing there was a cop there for some reason. And I walked by and I like I did like the heel click and I just did this. <laughs> <laughs> he was like he was like what? And I was the like, yeah, thank you, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you for your service. <laughs> thank you for your service, sir. I dive in her cervix. <laughs> How's uh, the wedding? When I was sick. Who was getting married? Uh, my friends, Richie and Amanda, shout out. Um, it, was a, it was a great wedding. It was beautiful. It was classy. Where was it? Uh, Sharon, Massachusetts. Okay. You know. I don't know. Uh, you know the fucking vibes. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, it was great. So saw, you know, some old college people. It was, it's fun. It's it was funny. college buddies? Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's funny seeing college people because, like, some of them, I'm like, okay, I'll see you guys. And then some people I see and I'm like. Never gonna see you. The again. next time I dude. see your name is gonna be in an obituary. Yeah, you know? <laughs> I'm never gonna see you never again. Never see you, dude. There was a kid at the wedding I went to in Rhode Island like two months ago, mm -hmm. and while we're all like dapping each other up, saying goodbye, uh, we're all like, "Oh, yo, see you soon." And me and this one kid were like, "I don't think we are gonna see each other soon." <laughs> we were just straight up like, "Good to see you, man." <laughs> and that was it, just straight up. I did that one time. I was in uh, REI. Very uh, classic white guy sentence. I was in <laughs> REI and uh, I ran into this kid I went to college with. And like, we weren't even boys in college, but like, uh, so he was like, oh, dude, like, you still in New York? And then I was like, yeah, yeah. And he was with his girlfriend that I also knew. And so, like, we, you know, we finished our pleasantries and I go, all right, well. And he was like, <laughs> he was like, what? And I was like, well, I mean, this That's is probably it, like, just the last time we'll ever see each other. <laughs> it's like, Oh no! Come on, man. We'll, and I was like, no, probably Dude, you not. You don't have to. You don't have to <laughs> pretend. Nothing makes me more mad than like that situation. The person's like, should we exchange numbers? Yeah. No. I don't think so. No. Yeah. No I, beef either. It's I, just why. It, yeah. <laughs> it's like if we didn't want to. If we don't have our numbers now, I'm 30 basically. Yes. You know, if I don't have your phone number, I don't want it at this point. I'm not getting like the number of someone I took like a marketing class with. No. I exactly. don't care. I'm not like, dude. You know what? That financial literacy class we took was actually fucking <laughs> that lit. Was sick. How are you doing? You were the man in that. I remember you would always give me the answers. Dude, are your parents still divorced, man? <laughs> What's going on with you, bro? Fuck it, just uh, yeah. So that was he was truly shocked when I was like, "Yeah, man, I think this Damn. is probably just the last time we'll ever speak." <laughs> and he was like, "He was like, oh, okay." This probably <laughs> this probably keeps him up at night. He's just like, "Fuck, that I John kid hates me." I know he talk, He says that story. Someone's like, yeah, Lamb's a freak. Like, he, <laughs> he fucking was gone. Just, you know? Oh, wait. Actually, producer Zach, do you mind flipping the, the – le the, I always keep forgetting to do that. Just flip that. Yeah, rotate it. 
Oh, yeah. Perfect. Um, Beautiful. I want to hear about the vitamin thing you were saying. Okay, so... <laughs> was this at the wedding or not? No. No. This okay. is yesterday. Okay, so... All right, so it, it was a wedding, so yeah. I'm I'm trying to stay lean, fit in my suit, you Heard know. That. So I was my man. I was, uh, uh, je ne sais quoi, starving myself <laughs> for like Wednesday. This, this is a pro and a pod. This is a pro and a pod, <laughs> and for like Wednesday, Thursday, I wasn't fucking eating pretty much anything. I was staying like sub 500 calories. Friday, I straight up don't eat anything. Uh, I go to the wedding and I'm so like sick that I still like can't even eat at the wedding. I'm like, I, I'm barely eating there and I leave the wedding. I go home. I almost debated driving back to New York at night at like, but I was like, it was like 11 and I was like, ah, I don't want to die at two forty in the morning in Connecticut, you know? Um, so then I got, uh, a bunch of McDonald's. I went to, oh man, this is like a real fat. Yeah. Move. I started off at McDonald's. Okay. I went to McDonald's, got a McDouble, got a McChicken. This is like midnight? Medi- yeah. Okay. Yeah. Got a medium fry, uh, a high C, very underrated. Definitely very underrated. underrated. I don't think I've had that in 15 years. It's maybe really more. fucking good. Yeah. Yeah. It bangs. Uh, and then I didn't, they, their fucking ice cream machine was down, of course. And so I kind of just went. Searching for a treat, <laughs> another <laughs> ice cream shop for a sweet for a sweet treat, and I ended up going to a Taco Bell, and I was for dessert or yes, just okay. yeah for dessert. They have Cinnabon delights. Yeah, I know. Okay, I know. <laughs> I know. I'm not that deep in the scene. I wouldn't know. <laughs> it's bad. Okay, so I was like, but of course I was like, I mean, I can't just get because they come in a two pack. Mm-hmm. And I was like, I can't walk up at fucking 1 a.m., get a two Cinnabon Delights, and then fucking leave. Like, I'm going to look like such a fat piece So you of have shit. to get tacos as well. So I got more food on <laughs> top of it to make it seem like I wasn't weird. Yeah, like, I'm not being weird. I'm yeah. not being fat. I was just like, getting no, 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 no there's things. more people with me. So I was like, I'll do a cheesy roll-up and, uh, like, a soft-shell taco. And he was like, great. Uh, and so I got that, ate that. I felt... Absolutely fucking miserable. The next day, I drive home. I don't uh, eat anything on my drive home. I get home. I'm starving. I order a pizza. A full... Let me be clear. Let's go. A full pizza. Medium, large. 14 inch. I don't know. I think 16 is regular large. Is it, but this is, this is a pie. Yeah. <laughs> this, this is a pie. And I ate the whole thing, top to bottom. Truly one of the grosser moments of mm-hmm. my life. Just like overcompensating for this being skinny. The few yeah, days just being like, I just I starved myself for a week, and I was like, okay, this is my time to shine, baby. What toppings? Uh, it was uh, a white pizza with taleggio, uh, sausage, caramelized onions, and hot honey. It was fucking. Deli- that sounds really good. It was fucking delicious. That's like kind of a uh, like extravagant for like doing fat shit. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I also hold on. Oh my god, that, Zach, is he in that frame bougie here? big boy shit? I'm in frame for <laughs> sure. You're all, okay. I can't see shit. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so I did that, and then the moment that I finished my last bite, I went to my bathroom and remembered that I had. <laughs> you have to take your vitamins. <laughs> I remember that I had laxatives. <laughs> That you had taken beforehand, or that I had taken like I I had them like a year ago for okay, something, yeah. And uh, so I just took three of them. Why? <laughs> Did you need like were you constipated? You, no. Oh, you but just... I was just like I was like I should pay for what I just did. <laughs> <laughs> I should I should pay for the price <laughs> for the sin I just committed. And so and I was like and also I'm gonna be stuffed up like I yeah, just yeah. ate an entire pizza like I'm not gonna make a bowel movement for a week. So I had. Had you pooped yet from the McDonald's and Taco Bell? No, no. Uh, so I had three of them, uh, and two. And for anyone who hasn't taken them before, they recommend you take one, maximum two. Mm-hmm. I went three. Yeah. Waited about two hours. Took another one. I got four in me. You're fucking abusing. I do- yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like on the street. I'm like, come on, man, just give me one. Give me a little. You're hit. sober now, but you got to do it in some <laughs> yeah, way. Yeah, I got to do something. I'm crushing up laxatives. On, I just want to shit, baby. Come on. <laughs> Yo, let me take a dump. <laughs> come on, baby, let me take a dump. I'll give you five dollars. Let me take a dump. I'll suck your dick if I can take a shit right now. Um. So. So you took a fourth. So I took a fourth. 
uh, they take, and this is something I didn't read. I just thought they worked like kind of instantly. I don't know like why, what mechanism or what pharmaceutical would just immediately what, make you what shit. What was this? The lax uh, Ducalot or something Dukalax, like that? It's yeah. literally called, du- what is it? Ducalax. Yeah. Oh, I thought it would be called yeah. uh, Ducalot, which is funny. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, that's a former, that's a former client. Ducalot. <laughs> um, but so it's like seven o'clock by the time I take this. Yeah. Ducalax. And so they take six to 12 hours to set in. When I tell you. So were you like asleep? At 3 a.m. Like I wake today I, or? I, Oh, yeah. Okay. 3 a.m. I wake up with the worst pain of my entire life. I think someone has stabbed me in the middle yeah. of the night. I wake up like like I've been like a samurai snuck in my room and cut my throat. <laughs> I wake up like that. And I immediately realized the moment I like the moment my eye opens a centimeter, I know I'm about you know to shit about my to shit pants. <laughs> I'm about to shit my pants, and I can't do that two for two in the same year. Yeah. Okay, uh, so <laughs> I sprint to the bathroom. As I'm running to the bathroom, I'm taking my pants off as I'm running. Yeah, I, <laughs> I, 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 I like picture you running down <laughs> that hallway, like pants around your ankles, pants around my ankles. I try to get out as I get out. <laughs> as I get out, one foot, the other foot gets caught. I Did you just trip? <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> I just it was like you know in like a, a cowboy fucking video game when you like lasso someone and it cinches around their legs yeah, yeah. and they just stop. I literally was running and I was like <laughs> and I just <laughs> went over like that and, <laughs> and everything came out. No, I be really thank God I well, like I Farted as I hit the ground. It was very. It was like a something out of like a vaudeville like a, act. It sounds it like, like Family Guy. Yeah, yeah, it was like that. And then I like got into the you know the situation room, uh, and it was one of the worst experiences of my life. It was so unbelievably sounds so painful. painful. It was like a fire hose was coming out of my ass. It was uh, it was haunting. I wanted to change my skin afterwards. Uh, my it's like hurting my stomach to think about because yeah, I kind of know what you're talking about. It was horrible. My my bathroom smelled like an abortion clinic. It was disgusting. <laughs> um, <laughs> Maybe note that we censor that. Nah, <laughs> so I'm kidding. Fine. No, that's no, 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 no. Uh, that sucks. Yeah. A lot. So uh, no to those at home. Viewers that at is home. what episode this is this? Ten. That is now this two. Is technically eleven. Okay. This is now like maybe or. This might be twelve. Okay. Well, it's now two I, stories. Yeah, no, actually, no, no. This is of 11. Lamb 11. shitting his pants. Yeah. On the podcast, maybe third time you're telling the story. Yeah, though. and it makes you wonder, you know, what hap- What would happen if the planes never hit the tower? You know? It does make you think about that. It makes you wonder because I don't think this would. I would be where I am right now if that didn't happen. That's possible. Yeah. Some would say I'm grateful. A lot of things would be different if 9/11 didn't happen. <laughs> a lot of things <laughs> would be different. Uh, so yeah, it was a, a really like not good situation. I still am feeling the effects right now. Like I feel yeah. you, you ever like get a li- like you get a wave of like illness or something and you're like, yeah, I have lupus. Yeah. You just don't feel clean after you don't feel good. No, I, I feel like what in my ideal world, someone would take an umbrella and put it inside of my stomach, and just open, it, open it, and then drag everything out of my stomach, and just just scrape the sides like mm-hmm. it was. They're scooping Ben and Jerry's. There's got to be a, be- a better method. Than yeah, there's got to be something else. I got to do a cleanse of some sort. Um, so yeah, so if I run out of the podcast, you know what happened. If Moses yeah. just starts talking for a long tangent. And you hear like little thudding footsteps. Have running you away. have you pooped again? Like, is it still like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I went this morning, but I I fear that it's not over. Yeah, um, it's usually not over. No, and plus I've been drinking coffee, iced coffee, yeah. so. poop juice. Yeah, <laughs> I'm drinking my poop. I have to take a shit, but poop I'm gonna juice. I'm gonna wait till after this is done. Okay, good. So take the shit. Damn. Okay. I appreciate that. another poop story. Thanks for so tuning yeah. in, guys. <laughs> uh, another poop story. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. We appreciate yeah. you. Um, um, before we get into anything else, yeah, we did this on the Patreon, but uh, I want to give our regular listeners a peek, a quick State of the Union. Okay. Yeah, we weren't w- so we recorded an episode. Um, we weren't able to drop the episode, unfortunately, but we went over a State of the Union on that episode of the pod, just to give you guys an insight on how things are going, because we know you guys are here for riding for the boys. Okay. Mm-hmm. The pod is going very well. So here's some BTS, guys. Some BTS. The pod is going really well. We have close to a thousand subscribers now on YouTube. You know, yeah. pull, pull us up a live check. Last hey, time I checked, you know what, Zach? Pull that up. Pull that up, Zach. <laughs> uh, yeah, just do YouTube or awkward hug YouTube channel. Uh, 
I we were cl- we were near eight hundred or so, or we had just passed eight hundred. It's what's, in the top. What's going right, on, Zach. man? It's in the top right. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. Just go to YouTube.com. Yeah. Uh, so we were nearing eight hundred subs on there. We got uh, the channels got around twenty thousand views. Channels bumping. Each each pod gets a couple hundred downloads per episode. The Leah app bad. was the biggest one. Was it? Yeah. Okay, huge. Um. It's funny the the Phil app was the biggest YouTube one and the Lee app was the biggest audio one. That <coughs> that tracks. That make, yeah, that makes yeah. perfect sense. Um. So yeah, the pod is going good. So yeah, what do we have for subs now? Can we like make this bigger? Yeah, yeah. yeah hit hit Command Plus on there. And we'll make everything bigger. Hit it again. Yeah, that's go. it. What are we at? Eight fifty four. We're nearing a thousand. We're nearing a K. That's We're nearing like. A K. In, I mean, I was. T- I feel like a YouTube subscriber is worth like a lot. I I think it kind of is. <laughs> yeah. I, I I I spoke with like a strategy guy recently, and he was like, the fact that you, he was like, I've been doing YouTube for a year, and I just crossed a thousand subscribers. So shit. Uh, Shout out y'all. That. Whoever is wa- watching us on YouTube, you I truly sick. don't know who it is. I looked at like a, a a breakdown of the demographics of it. It's very weird. So like. 70% of it's in the United States, 18 to 24 year old men, obviously. Uh, about My 20% boys. is female. So okay. I would like to bump that number up. I, I would, would love to bump that number up. I would love to make us a more female friendly podcast. Yeah, I don't uh, want to be like a guys only thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah cause, and also. Because I hate I, dudes. Let's also let's make something very clear. There's There's been a little bit of a, a muddying of the waters vis a vis our uh, affiliations because we've posted a clip that, that popped off a little about. Bruce, or excuse me, Caitlyn Jenner, and it attracted the wrong people. The wrong that people. is on me for. <laughs> <laughs> I texted. I, I, t- <laughs> I texted him before he posted it. I was like, "Make sure you include in the caption here that we're a pro-trans, anti-Caitlyn Jenner podcast." Yeah, but I do that, and then I tag Republican, <laughs> conservative, <laughs> MAGA. <laughs> And then all these fucking losers in the comments were like, oh, I knew it was over when he started fucking getting famous. And I'm like, Jesus Christ. And I kept responding to them being like, fuck you, yeah, kill fuck yourself. You guys. <laughs> yeah. So we're we're on your side. Yeah. We're very, Whatever yeah. your side is, we're on that side. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Just right down the middle, baby. Yeah. Sit on that fence. Just kidding. Uh, no, but I'm... yeah, just to just so the demographic split pretty <laughs> heavily male. Seventy uh, percent in the United States, twenty percent in Turkey. I I, I feel like that's bots. It might not be bots. It's either bots. I feel like it's probably just like teenagers who use reels in Turkey, and they just want to yeah. know about American shit. Turkey does seem like a place that would use reels. Yeah, yeah. they're just obsessed they with. Don't have, they want to know TikTok. what we do. Turkey is surprisingly online. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. The kids go. Hassan because they love uh, America. From Turkey, that's they what I'm saying. Love they love. They want. I'm down to have some internet. Let's do a tour. Okay. Yeah. I fuck with that. I love Turkish uh, bitches. So, so yeah, and then uh, I think that's really all the the pressing demographics of the pod. So yeah, pod's going well. We appreciate yeah. everyone's support. As always, again, patreon.com slash offer. This, this has been a good time. Uh, it's been a fucking blast. Uh, so we appreciate everyone coming on. Uh, all right. Let's actually, let's dive into it. Uh, I wanted to show you the, the weird OnlyFans girl. Yeah, yeah. Please Zach, I think I have her name on the notes. Can you find her on TikTok? Um, it's this Asian chick. I posted her to my story the other day, mm, but she has know. like really. I think her name is like your waifu girl. Yeah, this chick. Yeah, put on any of these videos. I want to watch a few of these. <laughs> it's, you're gonna be so uncomfortable. This is okay. <laughs> what is the video dimension here? You full screen this? Yeah, what's going on here? Okay, whatever. Oh yeah, this is, find one of the ones where she's like kissing you. <laughs> what? It's so weird. It's 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 super super weird. Oh no. She has an OnlyFans. She has an OnlyFans. Okay. That track. Oh yeah. Oh, that, do do that, do that, for, do yep, that yep, first yep, one.
How do you feel? Can you grab the Mullen Broncos? Oh. A million followers. I feel the least. A million followers. In a long time. Doesn't this piss you off? Oh, I mean, that's I wanna... the best part of the video, and then it gets terrible. <laughs> Next one. Ah, God. I want to be able to do this. <laughs> Dude, you for a month, you should just do this on the Awkward Hug channel. <laughs> <laughs> for the people who followed us for our racist jokes, and just start being like, oh, my God. For the audio listener, we're watching uh, this TikTok girl. Her whole page is just her making out at the camera. Oh, it's super, super, super uncomfortable. This is a bummer to watch. Yeah. She's not even like making out, just like little pecs. Yeah, yeah, yeah not even making she's, like, she's doing forehead smoochies. Yeah. Which I don't like. Well, I mean, IRL, Her lips yeah. are super wet in that one. Pause. Oh, yeah, go to that one. <laughs> Wait, no, go to that one. Which yes. one? This? <laughs> what is happening there? Why is she always hanging out of the car? Okay, at least she put lip gloss on in this one. Look, this one's this super is wet. Weird. I mean, yeah, that's insane. If you're gonna do these videos, you're a creep, whatever, fine. But put lip gloss on. Some of yeah, these yeah. bitches dry as hell. Yeah, I just wanted you to see this. She, she made went me, to Vassar. She made that's me crazy. Wait, what? Did she? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> like holy shit, she went valedictorian. to Valedictorian. Yeah, Valedictorian. <laughs> Uh, wait, go to the one where she's super zoomed in on her eyes. Foot unboxing time? Foot unboxing? Okay. I, I hope it cuts before she gets the toes out. Oh. Ugh. Ha. Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! I remember last episode I said I was kind of getting into feet. This made me get this, out of feet. Get, yeah. By the way, really, I got a lot of blowback from that. Really? Yeah. From like people in your from, personal life. From yeah, from <laughs> from people in my personal life, and then like also people from like kept coming out of the woodwork. Yeah. Being like, oh, you never told me that when we were together, and I'm like, shut the <laughs> shut fuck up. up. Would that have changed things? <laughs> yeah. Would we still get be together? Get out of here, you fucking freak. Oh man, yeah, this girl rocks. Yeah, though. she's. What's sad. her? Can we? Uh, it, what? What is the link she got? Okay, here we go. <laughs> nice. Uh, nice. Nice. Yeah, we'll put po- we'll post this to the page this for everyone to look at. This is the most like incel. Be- I mean, she's pantering to the incels. Yeah, who are, like who've never kissed a girl, which like it's crazy know. to think about someone masturbating to that. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna try probably, but. <laughs> <laughs> you could get it done. You, no. you got perseverance. No, I just actually, you know what? I just I uh, saw it today, and I was like thinking about trying semen retention. Okay, we're gonna be <laughs> one of those one of those podcasts now. No, <laughs> the manosphere. Yeah. So, do you know who I saw talking about it? Oh. Adrian Grenier. <laughs> Vince. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Vince, first of all, shout out greatest show of all time. Yeah, entourage. But um, Vince was like, yeah, he was like dead serious, being like, he was like, you know, when I give my life force, my chi to someone else, he like doesn't fuck like that anymore, and he doesn't masturbate, and he's like, talks about all these crazy benefits, and I'm like, I mean, also, I jerk off too much. I, yeah, I gotta, I my numbers are just how much is too much, like. <laughs> Upwards of three times a day. That's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. Twenty eight. Yeah. How? I Dude, I mean, I don't know. Uh, I feel here's like that's a lot. How much do you jerk off? Every other day. Yeah, I'm like every like four to five times a week. Oh yeah, I'm I'm three times a day. Standard. Who has the time? I dude, I'm a I'm a quick bus. <laughs> Maybe you do need semen retention. I probably do. Yeah. yeah. I I mean I don't, and it's not even it really. What are the benefits? It's not even a thing where I'm like it truly is like a McConaughey ass thing where I'm just like, it's, just, I, it's not a I'm not horned up just being like I need to jack off right now. Yeah. It's just I'm like ah this is like a going to the gym extension you know. Mm. Maybe not. I mean that's kind of how I usually jack off after the gym, like as a. It's just part of my routine. Yeah. yeah. You can't jack off before Do the gym. Do you shower first? No. Mm, so you're just grabbing your sweaty dick. Sweaty hog. You guys shower before jacking off? I want to shower. I mean, I want to shower I after and get jack myself off clean. After I go to the gym and get sweaty. Yeah. Man, I'm going to shower. I'm about to shower. That's. 
I feel like it's not that weird. I'm not going to jack off before the gym. Relationship get rid of my testosterone. You got to keep it up. Yeah. Semen retention. I get it. Semen retention is also the same people who are like sunning their asshole. Oh. They're what? Perennium sunning. Yeah. You know Have about you seen this? this butthole no. sunning? Yeah, pull that up. Pull that up. <laughs> sunning your asshole. You haven't seen that shit? Oh. Sun- what? Uh, oh, <laughs> all, good save. All I'm picturing when I when I hear sunning your asshole is someone like, it is dissing like, an asshole, oh. <laughs> being like, "You full of shit, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> you little ass bitch! You hairy ass bitch!" <laughs> Perennium sunning is sick. You just got sun, boy. <laughs> we should bring that back. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Why you shouldn't try perennium sunning? What the fuck? Is this real? Yeah, butthole sunning. Why? You get like the sun's energy straight into like. What do you mean the sun's energy? Have a fucking vitamin D pill, you oh, freaks. Oh, that one picture. Is that a ball top, sack? On the top row by the... Oh, no. Second row. Oh. This, oh, this oh. shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you've seen this. You're... No. <laughs> oh. I have not. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Okay. No, no, no. Uh, yeah, it's good for you, apparently. Yeah. I'm going to pass on that. Why? You don't want the energy? I just don't think I could make that move. Yeah. I think if I did that move, inherently, shit would just fall out of my ass. <laughs> like, I don't think I have the anal retention mm. to have shit not just fall out of my ass if I yeah. did that. Position. I... I just wouldn't do it at that pose. I would bend over. <laughs> <laughs> Downward facing dog. Yeah, doggy <laughs> style. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, ho- I'm holding my ass cheeks in my yard to get the sun. <laughs> That's a crazy. <laughs> that would be a crazier position than this. That would be so funny. Your head down, ass up. Sun's touching your butt. Hell yeah, dude. That rocks. <sighs> Uh, but yeah, uh, this is good. Well, we should do a challenge. For yeah, month. awkward uh, butthole sunning. I was gonna say oh. the semen retention thing. Oh, the semen retention. Uh, yeah, someone's gonna yell at me about like you shouldn't have shared that. I'm like, my family listens to this sometimes. They and do. Like, yeah, which I don't like, even know if my mom knows what a podcast I is. I shouldn't have told them. <laughs> uh, and they're like, you can't. Yet you should. No, no. And I'm like, eh. I mean, they're probably right. Yeah, but I don't care. Whatever. <laughs> Who cares? Uh. But uh, yeah, no, I uh, we should do that for a month. We Semen retention. Yeah, we should. Are you allowed to fuck? Uh, but I can't. I just can't. Come. Can't bust. We could make this happen. I think we could do that. Yeah. Do you want to be involved? You're on the team now. <laughs> do we want to do a no jack off month? Sure. No jack off June. Okay. No jack off June. No jack off June. All right, this could work. I have He's a bat. like, you just did a calendar of pussy in your mind. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, oh, I just did the same thing. I was like, I have this plan. Yeah. I have this plan. I just said, how many days do I have left to jerk off then? Three. Yeah. Three. You got to you, you can squeeze it all in. I actually think I'm already squeeze it all out. done. I was <laughs> <laughs> yeah, r- ring the you ring those towels. You up. hit your monthlies by like week two. Yeah, like know, you're good. I know. Um, I'm down. Okay. Should we put like money on it or something? I would do that. Sure. Or like a. Uh, like a punishment if you do jack off, and you gotta, I mean, you gotta like, be it honest. It really is an honor system thing. Yeah, I mean, I'm if a man you, of my word. All right, if you lose, you have to do perennium sunning, but with the last dab as well. Ooh, oh, do the last dab again. Yeah, I like that. We have to do that on camera again. I'm down with just because like that was such a fucking aces. That was good. <sighs> and I've been I've been using the sauces. Stupid. Really? Not the bad ones, yeah, obviously. The bad one. Uh, yeah, we we should do that again. I yeah. would uh, whoever uh, I don't know who we're gonna end up having. Find a food weekend. guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we should do yeah. it next weekend. Yeah. Um. Oh yeah. Also, uh, let us know What's who up? you want to be on the show. Uh, we have like a list of guests that we yeah. have coming up that are fucking awesome guests. But if there's anyone you want to hear on the show, let us know, please. Let us know in the yes. comments uh, section uh, in my DMs. DMs. In my DMs. Our DMs. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, just slide me a message. Yeah. <laughs> um. Yeah. I don't. Okay. Yeah. So we'll do that one month, starting June. The awkward hug production team. No jack off. No jack off. June. I'm gonna be good. I get wet dreams, so we're straight. What? If I don't jack off for a few days, I'll just come. Nah. <laughs> Are you doing. a baby? No. Nah. Are you 14? I just gotta get it out. <laughs> gotta get the poison out. <laughs> <laughs> my body has to get has to I, eject I it. have. Proudly, never in my life had a wet dream. Yeah, how, I, don't, I don't think I have either. How do you how do you have a wet dream and like your mom comes to wake you up for school? Like how you know? Mom's not waking me up for school. Well, not now, but like you obviously, if you if you're having it now, you definitely had it when you were like 15. Yeah. What do you mean? So what? Your mom comes in, wakes you up for school. Hey, honey. My mom wasn't waking me up for school. Oh, uh, you didn't have a good mom. No, I had a great mom, but I was like an wow. adult. We had, we had alarm clocks. Yeah, I have an alarm uh, clock. Uh, I drove myself to school. Like I was not like. Okay, maybe I'm a fucking baby. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> yeah. If anything, I woke up before my mother in high school. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. Well, my my mom wakes up at like three in the morning. She's on her uh, fucking Casey Neistat shit. I don't actually know if it's him that does that. I forget. That's uh, Mark Wahlberg. It's in a, yeah, that's who it is. Yeah. Uh, very uh, people mix those guys up. Yeah. All the time. They're trying to cancel Mark Wahlberg again. <laughs> Why? Because he <laughs> did he beat up another <laughs> Chinese <laughs> person? He beat up two Chinese people. <laughs> De- never forget that. Ne- look, I'm gonna like tighten two. up on this. Mark Wahlberg <laughs> did a hate crime. Yeah. He hate crimes back Chinese to man. back. He. Yeah. Beat the shit out of one Chinese dude, yep. and then that guy called the cops. And while he was like escaping and running around the neighborhood, he found another Chinese dude God, and nice. was like, "Yo, like walk with me, so like I don't like get popped by these cops." Yeah. And then he beat the he shit, beat out, of the shit out of that guy. He was like trying to get five stars. <laughs> <laughs> Going GTA mode on there. Yeah, pull that up, Zach. Just search yeah. Chinese guy, please. Mark Wahlberg, Chinese guy. Is it on his Wikipedia Probably. that he beat the shit out of someone? Boogie, remember the fake dick Whatever. he had? Boogie, he he beat the shit out of him with the fake dick he had from Boogie Nights. <laughs> 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 uh, that was a good movie. Um, it wouldn't be. What, he would get, he would scrub just, this from just, his did Wikipedia. Did you just search Chinese on the Wikipedia page? Oh, a Viet. Oh, legal issue. Well, you kept saying Chinese. He's Vietnamese. Oh, whatever. Um, yeah, egg on your face. Yeah. <laughs> Egg foo yawn on my face, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. Oh, yeah. Let's uh, pull. Okay. Vietnamese. He assaulted 16. He assaulted a middle-aged man. Calling him a Viet- A Vietnam fucking, fucking shit. shit. That's not even, like, gr- not grammatically even, correct. I'm going to come up with, like, five better <laughs> ethnic slurs right now. Uh, and With a large wooden With a large stick. wooden stick. Why did he have a wooden stick he, on him? The same day he attracted Johnny Trin, another Vietnamese. Damn, he clocked him. Punching one, him in the one eye. One time when I was in high school, he got, we were looking up, like, we were doing some history class about stuff in, like, Central Asia and stuff, uh, and someone, this kid, I, I was like, there, there was, we were talking about, like, Vietnam, Korea, and Thailand and stuff, and I was like, oh, like, I, I can't, like, tell the difference between, like, in terms of, like, facial, I, I was like, I obviously know yeah, yeah. there's differences, I just, like, I can't discern them. Yeah. And he was like... That's so racist. I was like, well, I'm not. I, I, I'm. I'm saying. I'm not saying they all look the same in the countries of their own. I'm just yeah. saying, like, I couldn't tell the difference between like a person from Vietnam and a person from Thailand. Yeah. Probably. I don't think that's racist. You're from like Massachusetts. It's like also like that would like, be like, can you tell the difference between someone who lives in like Louisiana versus Canada? It's yeah, like, yeah, No, yeah, they're yeah, fucking yeah. from the same kind of general yeah. region. Like they're both, and they're. It's not. They're both Asian. It's yeah. not like you know. I'm not saying. I mean, I think alike. I know I the difference now, them. but like, I there was definitely a point where I was like, I don't really. Know. Yeah, yeah. I think. What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> That's a charged question. Yeah, we don't we don't have to get into it, but like, you got to pay yeah. a wall that one. <laughs> you know. Uh, speaking of, wait, you want to hear something pretty racist? Actually, uh, <laughs> um, so my brother, like, he does theater. And he just booked a gig. He's going to go do Sister Act in Seoul. Oh, whoa. So we're like planning. Hey, what the fuck? You have an actor brother? Yeah, he does like theater. He's in like Missouri right now. I don't know. What the um, fuck? How old is he? About to be 25. Wow. I yeah. Know that. That's crazy. Um, and so like obviously like me and my family are planning a trip to go to the, like we don't go to any of the shows, but he's going to South Korea. I'm going to fucking go. It's going to be sick. Um, and so my mom, she calls me yesterday. And she, <laughs> yeah, he already knows it's probably something pretty racist. Oh, no. um, and she was like, yeah, I don't know if we should do a hotel or an Airbnb. Like, what if we don't like the hotel food? And I was like, first off, we're going to be eating out. We're on vacation. Yeah. And then I was like, what do you mean? What if we don't like it? She's like, well, you know, like how they eat over there. Like, we don't know if there's going to be like rats or cats in the food. And I was like, I don't know that actually what do you mean <laughs> like what do you mean she's like i don't know like it might not sit well with us i was like they I like don't say shit like that when we go over there <laughs> do not yeah uh man that, yeah they don't eat cats the, or rats they, they definitely do not, don't eat rats for sure yeah uh and they don't eat cats i i believe it that it is uh like cambodia they eat like pets that we have or like mm. animals that we have as pets now and china and like Fucking rural ass areas, but like you're not just getting dog. You're not gonna, yeah, you're not like getting Tokyo. You're not getting you know? dog at the Seoul, KFC. Yeah, Seoul, I was like, yeah. I was like, we're going to the capital. Like we're going to be fine. Yeah, there's gonna be a McDonald's. It's <laughs> yeah. not, you know, a giant wet market. Uh, yeah, that's awesome. Also, I'm pretty okay, pumped. She's gonna be whack on that trip. 1992, Mark Wahlberg fractured the jaw of his neighbor, Robert Crean. Okay, got a white. 
Uh, <laughs> but he's probably gay. <laughs> I mean, why else would Mark Wahlberg punch a white guy? <laughs> what are you fucking gay? Uh, oh nope, he was called a racial slur. Oh wait, mm. hold on. Hmm. Uh, attorney claimed that Mark and McCall, who is black, were provoked after McCall was called a racial slur. But, oh, 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 he was defending someone who was called a racial slur. Oh, Wahlberg said the right thing for him to do would be to meet with. Oh. Trin released a public statement for giving Wahlberg. Nice. A racist will always be a racist. I don't think Mark Wahlberg, no. um, his mind, I don't think his mind is different. I think he probably still hates um, minorities. Yeah. He He's just good that. about doing it in private now. His whole new thing is fucking sucks. He, his new oh, thing, his oh, merch. Oh, oh. Have you uh, seen that? I have. It's yeah. really bad. I watched it departed last night. It, so Boston. Perfect video. movie. Perfect. I haven't movie. seen it. We've gone over this. I haven't. Oh, I don't pay attention to anything. Yeah. Uh, that's crazy. I would love to see it though. I, I will watch it with you. I'm, it's such a banger. I'm watching all the movies from the start. What do you mean? <laughs> all of them? Yeah. I'm what do you mean? All, all of, of the, the movies. movies. The departed cinematic universe. No, you? just the movies in general. Like, <laughs> like <laughs> the first movie. It's the first movie. Yeah. Um. Okay. Well. Uh, the Departed fucking bangs. It is perfectly cast. It's a fucking perfect movie. Is that just the heist movie in Boston? Am I no, wrong? No, no, no. Okay, that's no. the town. Also, banger of a that's movie. That's the one I'm thinking of. Uh, the Departed is uh, Jack Nicholson, Leo, Matt Damon, uh, fucking uh, Mark Wahlberg, uh, Martin Sheehan, uh, Alec Baldwin. It's Vera Farmiga. It's it's stacked. I love it's, Vera Farmiga. It's the only movie that has utilized Mark Wahlberg properly where he's... Uh, Is he just like a piece of shit? Mm, kinda. He's like a racist, like hilarious guy and like he's not the titular character which is what he's... He's not meant to be. Like, yeah. He's not a leading man. He's not a case. leading man at all. He was a... He's... He is perfect in that fucking movie. Uh, he just has like a hilarious Boston accent and he's like... It, it's just... Uh, it's great. I'm not gonna do it. Can you look up Vera Farmiga? Yeah. She's a fox. I'm in love with her. Yeah, she's beautiful. She was great in Base Motel. Yeah. Her daughter is also very The American Horror Story chick? Yeah. Yeah. She's, she's very They're good bad. Too. Uh, but yeah, Departed, perfect movie. That's uh, If Mark Wahlberg had kept doing roles like that for the rest of his career, I would respect him. But now he's doing... He, he has this whole new thing where he's back into religion a ton. And oh, like he, yeah. He's he a bad guy he's now. He's been doing ads for an app, a prayer app. That like you have to get up and and molest a kid or so I don't know it's something like that you got to get up at two a.m. you got to get up at two a.m. have sex with a kid gym, pray beat the shit out, out of the Vietnamese have guy sex with a kid another Vietnamese <laughs> yeah Vietnamese kid then yeah that's yeah. his morning routine yeah, wake up three a.m. Yeah, golf yeah. three thirty <laughs> rape a Vietnamese woman <laughs> yeah. When that's what his like power up is when he gets both a Vietnamese and a kid. He's getting a multiplier on that one. Uh, He's yeah, very Farmiga, babe. Babe. Also very underutilized. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so that's good. Damn, uh, all right, what's next on the agenda for us? Uh, I want. Do you want to talk about the armored Ubers? Have you seen these? Yeah. Wait. What? <laughs> Dude, <laughs> pull it up. I I forget what they're called. Armored Ubers? The armored Ubers, for, let me see. Who is it meant for? For anyone. For civilians. For freaks. Um, It's like this guy that used to be in the army, or maybe not. Wait, I, no. Can we look at... No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay. Did you see the song I sent you? <laughs> yeah, well, I saw that on Twitter. Okay. Yeah. Let's watch that. Okay. Let's watch that. Can you search uh, Target rap song MAGA? <laughs> <laughs> okay, but then I found the name of the fucking... Navy Ubers. I love coffee. How many coffees do you have a day? Um, maybe two, but I do have pre workout like most days. Do you when you have two, are you like jacked up or are you just like feeling good? It goes in waves. Sometimes I'm jacked up and I'm like, what the fuck? I wasn't jacked up yesterday and I had the same amount. I don't I, know. It really just I feel like I don't yesterday I had on the road I had a coffee and two Red Bulls and like I also was up till fucking. I, I drove ten hours, you know, pretty much, and like was up till f- two a.m. So like, yeah. but I wasn't like wired, yeah. and I was like, do I have, you know, an addiction? Yeah. Uh, most of the time I'm not wired. Yeah, I think I might do. Like, I get maybe. excited when I am though. I'm like, let's go. Coffee's doing what it's supposed to do. Yeah. Maybe I should. Uh, maybe I'll take a break for like two weeks when we're doing our yeah. jerk off thing. 
All right, yeah, blow this up. Let's watch this. This is, uh, ironically, this has been stuck in my head for the last like three days. <laughs> Yeah. Wait. <laughs> Hold on, pause it. This fit is hard, by the way. First of all. What's this guy's What name? is your body shape? <laughs> what is it? He's shaped like the Mucinex man. Um, wait, what is he? Wait, does he think what is Tampax are woke? Yeah, wait, what yeah. is this? <laughs> Damn, man. Women trying to stop bleeding in public. <laughs> this is, what's this song about? If, I don't know. Target had like some clothes that like let kids like tuck if they wanted to tuck. If they're, which like, what? I don't tuck, give a like, shit. Their dick. Their dick. Yeah. Oh, so this is like an anti. Oh yeah, the yeah. whole thing where like people were like, but it, was, it wasn't like in the kids section; it was like in the pride section. Yeah, yeah, they had like a, which like yeah, okay. I don't sure. I just don't give a put a gun in the store. I don't care. I don't <laughs> fucking care. I just don't give a shit. Uh yeah, Tampa. Oh man. Uh, like, yeah. Fuck the tampons are gay. <laughs> the t- he's like, man, these tampons are gay. What's funny is these guys all look like this, all have the same beard. But their voices are all like, yeah, fuck Target. <laughs> They're all super high. Wait, look at this right, guy's yeah. tattoos. He has the Statue of Liberty on his face and then 1776 across his forehead. Living like a, living like I died Living like before. I died before. That's hard. That's actually kind of hard. Um, all right. 1776. When is he a white guy? No. Yeah. No what a fucking yeah. bootlicker. I hate him. Press play. <laughs> That guy's the best. Wait, 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 wait. What did he just say? <laughs> I'm only rocking rockin with, with Bruce. Bruce. I ain't rocking with, with, with Jenner. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Wait, he had a bar before that. He's like, they're promoting sexual genders. Yeah. I love that. That doesn't mean anything. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> None of these people that are fr- like complaining about this understand any of the vernacular that's coming <laughs> out of the They don't know what they're, they're like, talking about. Man, sexuality and gender, and they're being fluid, <laughs> and, they're, and the fluidity's coming out of yeah. them. <laughs> that guy can't spell spectrum. Like he doesn't know what's going on. <laughs> he doesn't this get it. Motherfucker on the spectrum, yeah. much less spelling it. Oh my god. Uh, yeah. His All beard right. is sick he, though. The, the, his the. I feel like those shorts were made in 1989. Like those yeah. are the longest shorts I've ever seen in my life. This fit is sick. This fit is so. This guy's probably right, keep, five keep going, seven. Keep going. Target, yeah, they targeted. <laughs> this, this, the hook catches. You, it does. It does. <laughs> the, the, okay, wait, dude, this guy's dusty. <laughs> this guy is the dusty. You're doing a fucking fucker. music video. This is your fit. Yo, this fucking guy. He looks like he bought that at Target. <laughs> <laughs> no, he looks like he just came from an intramural game. Like, what the <laughs> fuck is this fit? What what's he got on the sh- what's he got on the feet? Can we back it up and see a couple frames? Let's see if we can get his, his toesies in there. Yeah, this fit also is trash. being in the toy section, I'm like. <laughs> oh yeah, he's got air force. He's got the white. Not, <laughs> they don't even look like air force. They look like nurse shoes <laughs> with steel toes in them. Uh, That's awesome, dude. These guys are dusty, man. Also, what is like the the predator like cloaking effect? <laughs> I think he put it on. <laughs> I don't understand. They look like in Black Mirror when you're blocked. Do you know the episode? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It yeah, yeah. blurs you out. Yeah. All right. Keep running. Keep running. Okay. The next bar, the next uh, verse after this is the funniest of the whole thing. It's this fat beach ball in the back. It's going to start singing. He used to be on American Idol, too. What? Yeah.
Wait, is he Jewish? <laughs> no. No, they're all. No, he's a fucking. He's uh, uh, that's Albanian, not, yeah. I guarantee. Oh. Ah. Uh. Yo, back that up, back that up, back that up, back wait, wait. that up, back that up, back that up. He's not a bad singer. No, he's a good singer. <laughs> Targeting our kids. <laughs> back that up a bit. This is the best. He's literally like in, they were like, all right, yo, his name is Jimmy Lee, first of all. They were like, oh, yo, Jimmy Lee, okay, um, gallantly skip through the aisle, okay? And then hit play. No, 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 back, back it up more. You got to see the beginning of it. This is, I like that he's got the black AF ones on. Yeah. Black Air Force activity right here. Watch this little hop he does. <laughs> <laughs> They targeted your kids. <laughs> He's just picking what is up he tampons. Doing? He's just picking up tampons. Target. Target. Yeah, they targeted. Target. Yeah, they targeted. <laughs> Kill yourself. That, that, that song is sick. Man, um, those guys are such fucking losers. What's did the, they ask permission before they went in and filmed in there? Or they just no went probably not. Yeah. No way. They just robbed Imagine them. you're just like getting groceries. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, some mom is like, okay, sharp cheddar, got it. Sour yeah. cream, got it. Ooh, the Oikos. That's on sale. Nice. 45 year old guys. <laughs> Target. Targeting. <laughs> it's like. Come on, honey. Don't don't like, go down that aisle. <laughs> Sweetheart, let's go. Let's go now. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. What's funny, too, is that, like, look, I almost hope that, like, the right wins this, like, psychotic culture war because, like, all three of those guys are going into, like, enslavement immediately. <laughs> if they, like, <laughs> like, all, all three of those guys are getting enslaved. Yeah, they don't. They just like, are. Those aren't white guys. No, right? no. That's what, not yeah, one of them is white. so weird. I can't. You're like, you guys are about to find out what eugenics yeah, is, they dog. Hate you. <laughs> you're about to learn your skull shape. You okay? got 1776 like, on you your forehead. These, these mother, they're fucking, if you think, if they're. If you think this is mask off for them, you got another thing coming, bro. Yeah. They're not going to fuck with you as soon as they get their way. They're like going to be like, great, we stopped it. We did it. The white people, or no. excuse me, the Republicans <laughs> are in control. And uh, we're, at, we're, we're actually, they're going to do that like skin tone test from Family Guy. They're like, oh, okay, <laughs> perfect. Ooh, Jimmy Lee, just move him over there. This side. Uh, yeah. So. Wait, Zach, you should go to their Instagram, I feel like. Yeah. The Oh, I think you meant the the... I wonder what rap group the name is for that. I feel like there. I've seen the the one with the tattoos on his face. I've seen him on Twitter before. Yeah, yeah I've seen. Like he's, he's, he goes viral every now and yeah, then. Yeah, it's very funny. Yeah. Um. He, I mean, ugh, oh man, he's just. It's so a good funny. niche. Do you think they're serious? Those guys. Yeah. Oh, 100 percent. They like. I looked up the Jimmy Lee guys. The guy who looks. First of all, he looks like someone. He looks like his hair is the pull up. Pull up Jimmy Lee really quick before we go into the other thing. His hair looks like if you took, like, if someone grabbed his legs mm. and put him up by a fishing line, upside down, <laughs> and then rolled him in paint. So it's like, like a paintbrush? Yeah. Using him <laughs> as a paintbrush. Jimmy Lee. Just search Jimmy Lee MAGA. Um, yeah, go to his, maybe find his IG. Did I just make up that his name is Jimmy Lee? You might have. Sir, go back to the MAGA rappers. Did I just did I hallucinate this? For sure. Just do MAGA. Yeah, MAGA. Go back. Hold on. Go back to the YouTube video. It'll be in there. There it is. Oh, you just had it. Up. Right. No, you had it. It's it's a tab up there. There we go. Yeah, let's get this. Just three guys Googling shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> now we're all a bit... Okay, whatever. Whatever. But I could have swore his name was Jimmy Lee, but his likes are very funny. We're like... They're all just evangelical freaks where they, like, think that the Lord is going to come back, like, 190 feet tall and kill everyone. He is. Zach, I just texted it to you. Oh. Um, I love being a Christian uh, guy. 
Who? Like a racist Christian guy. Yeah. Those guys are sick. Dame? Well, no, just a racist Christian guy. Oh, I just love, I love do- Dame. No, I love being one of those guys. Oh, oh, oh yeah. racist Christian guy? Yeah, it is kind of sick. It, it's nice because it's like built in, you know? It's in the like, Bible. Yeah, <laughs> like, it's like built in. <laughs> you uh, have a good excuse for it. Um, okay, go to the pinned one on the on the right. We'll just go to the DMs. It's basically... It, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, be my DMs. All right, so what is the name here? It's Black, Black Wolf. Black Wolf. It's basically Uber, but they got so many guns in there. <laughs> Zach, find the one where he's he's showing his trunk. Whoa, who who is asking for this? No one. <laughs> it's probably gonna crush though. This is how I'm pulling up to the podcast every single time now. <laughs> Isn't that weird? He got his dry cleaning <laughs> why, too? Why did he so get, you're just hiring an assistant. Why did he get out of the car? Yeah, it's yeah. if you want security. You're Dude, hiring a black assistant. Scroll down, Wait, find the one where he shows the trunk. Uh, Hopefully. <laughs> Maybe it's that one up there in the middle. No, up. That one. Or the one next to it. We reach sixty thousand downloads. We appreciate everybody. We have to try it. We yeah. have to go on a ride. This is one of the things. Yeah, you have. Zach, go to the one before this. Yes, you have sir. I, wa- I want you to see how many g- all these videos how many guns they keep in the <laughs> wait. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> Go go back. Exit out and click on this again. The 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 preview <laughs> The, like the young child's mouth. For the <laughs> clip, just says the young child's mouth. Dude, can <laughs> these people shut up? Yeah, I actually, I think I figured out a way to get that out of here. Okay. In the in the post, so we'll, I think I could figure that yeah. out. I also got uh, like like hexagon sound panels. Oh, sick. But I just I have to test on like what I can actually put them up with because I don't want to fuck up the paint. Yeah. Um, sure. Okay. Yeah. Play this. So you kiss him. This is. <laughs> what do they think is going to happen on this ride? Call, co- <laughs> calling Q-tips cotton tips so they're harder. <laughs> Emergency poncho. <laughs> so why mention them? Yeah. What did what do they think is gonna happen on these rides? Like know. I'm just going to a bar. This guy watched Final Destination and was like, "We need yeah. another way to transport." All right, Zach, get out of this one. Safety is last. My go to the concern. yeah the one that says all bulletproof my first windows. First concern: vaping. Second concern, crypto. <laughs> third concern. This is going to crush re- third Republicans. Concern, taking down the patriarchy. <laughs> Hold on, pause this. Pause this. Pause this. Pause this. Pause this. All I can picture is this fucking. E- <laughs> Hope y'all like guns. All I can picture is like this guy doing uh, like remember when Elon Musk did the Cybertruck test? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Him, he's like some guy <laughs> some sitting guy in the front seat, like, look, bulletproof windows. I'm <laughs> just fucking killing a guy in the front just seat. Just kills the first passenger. <laughs> he's like, look, we put a child in the front seat to show how safe this is. Just killing kids. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> All right, keep going. Where do they think we're going? The cop. Yeah. He, he's doing a presentation on stage, and he takes out a gun. The cops just shoot him. <laughs> That sucks. I mean, yeah. Uh, <laughs> All our vehicles have to come first aid. Duffel bag, that's for our drivers, tourniquet, fire extinguisher. This is 
<laughs> Are we not addressing the gun? <laughs> <laughs> the orange not, gun, by the not way. Say it's orange. It. Uh, um, I can't. This is gonna get so many. But yeah. poor young black men killed. It's not yeah. I mean, I hope black people don't do it. No. I other mean, than, other who, than this guy, he's targeting it's like black Republicans though, which is gonna be a bummer. Yeah, this is probably gonna crush. Yeah, probably. I, I, I mean, can, we're gonna take a drive. 100%. Do you think they have it here? Get you fired up. I'll download uh, it. I bet you it's only in like weird places right now. It's Once probably in here. like Raleigh. Yeah, I was just gonna say North Carolina. Right. That's weird. We're on the fucking same wave yes, like, recently. Um. Uh, if I could just search rally. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, we should do because I know we we talked about doing like. Uh, oh yeah, we should do one of those. Uh, where are we at? Uh, let's see. We're at. Uh, f- wow, we're fucking flying. We're fifty five minutes already. Oh, bet. That's crazy, man. Is Wait, is this related at all to like the body wash? No, right? No, no. Wait, no fucking way. There's no chance. Hopefully not. No way. No. No, the logos do look similar though. Yeah, I was gonna say they do look very similar. Yeah. Can you? Are you able to download it? Yeah, I got the app. Yeah, let's see. I'll fucking I'll get. I in don't the car. think you can do it yet. I don't think they're fully like. If if we can, I will literally do it right now. I don't care how much it is. It's called Black Wolf Execs. Fuck yes, dude. This is the Young Black Kings Club. Am I able to see like where cars are at? Okay, wait. This is sick, actually. Let's go to LaGuardia right now. We should have them take us to East New York. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There is currently no service to our location. Fuck. Fuck. They don't do it out here yet. We can't pull up in Browns. They don't want to protect they them. See if there's a. See, yeah, yeah. Be very funny in NB getting in the car. <laughs> 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 He's like, man, we need to use a tourniquet. She's like, they! <laughs> Uh, <laughs> wait, fuck. Fuck, can you, do they have like a customer service line? There's nothing in here. Just, hold on, just Google Black Wolf, fo- like customer service l- phone number, or Black Wolf phone number. Can you do that, Zach? Yeah, yeah, Google Black Wolf phone number, Fo- phone, phone number. I have to number. create an account, I'm afraid to do that. I want to get on the phone with someone there and ask how we can become a driver. I'm actually not going to put my phone number in here right now. Um, Uber with guns. <laughs> What did you say? Black Wolf what? All right, yeah, contact, contact. Up top. Personal protection, right? This is probably really expensive. Yeah, it's probably insane. Right there, perfect. Please tell me they have a fucking phone number. Get in touch. There is a phone number. Give me your phone. Yeah. Let's call it. What's the phone number? Oh, yeah, control plus that. 706-431. Is this just some guy's phone number? I think so. <laughs> oh, it would be in Atlanta. Of course it's based there. <laughs> it's Atlanta. Of course it is. <laughs> <laughs> now I kind of get it. Maybe they do need the bulletproof windows. <laughs> no one's going to answer. Watch. Hi, my name is uh, John Lamb. I'm with uh, Awkward Hug Entertainment. Um, <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, shit. Yes. It's ringing. Yes. <laughs> no one's going to answer the show. Hello, this is KB. Hi, KB. My name is John Lamb. Is this uh, Black Wolf? Fantastic. Uh, so as I said, my name is John Lamb. I am with uh, Awkward Hug Entertainment. We're based out of New York City. Um, I was looking to see if you guys are operating in the area. We'd love to try out your service. No, not, a, not as of yet. Um, we actually have the recruiting process. We have about, I would say, 10 NYPD officers uh, lined up. Understood. Uh, now, is it only NYPD officers? We'd love to see. I have a few friends. Uh, I'm a veteran myself. We have a few friends uh, who would love to be part of the operation. I don't know if there's like an application process or something like that. It's a baby crying in the background. Mm-hmm. 
they can do the uh, the free application online, and they can email me their uh, resume and fake credentials. Gotcha. Okay. Is there any certain credentials you're looking for, really? Yeah, well, of course, in, in New York, it's, it's a little bit different. So yeah. Of course, uh, Shot an innocent bystander or something? Understood. Understood. I appreciate that info. And then uh, just out of curiosity for our own organization, what's generally your your rate? Uh, for Do you guys do like hourly? Is it per destination? Uh, how does that work? Mm. Understood. Okay. All right. And last question here, and this is really just, I, I'm excited to hopefully use you guys soon. Uh, it's just a little bit of a, you know, just something for me. Uh, if I take a ride uh, with you, am I allowed to have any control over uh, the sound system at all? Mm. Okay. Maybe a Bluetooth situation. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh my God. Um, that was definitely that guy, right? <laughs> yeah. It was that guy, and he's like at home with his kids. <laughs> that was awesome. That was awesome. That was really funny. <laughs> uh, that was sick. sick. Oh um, wow. I think we're we're about an yeah. hour in now. Uh, that was beautiful. Thanks for listening what a great today, ending. gang. Uh, thanks for listening, everyone, to this episode of Awkward Hug. Yeah. I'm definitely gonna bleep out that last part. I thought yeah, it would be. Sure. I thought it would be f- try to make him think I'm just like a white nationalist, but <laughs> then I was like, mm, uh. I actually don't know if that bit plays very well. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, thank you so much for listening. Uh, go follow the boys on all the socials. Yes, uh, sir. I believe Awkward Hug Pod. Uh, and as always, please go to fucking subscribe to the Patreon. We give you an ep- an extra episode each week. Uh, an extra video episode. We're going to be adding more stuff to that too. We're going to be doing a lot more like behind the scenes, uh, like lifestyle shit. We're going to be doing a lot more content. We're going to be uh, doing some tings. Some tings, sketches, hopefully coming out soon. We're mm. working with some cool guests. We got a lot of stuff coming. Big things coming for the boys. Uh, so go subscribe, follow along. We love you. Goodbye. I love you. Ah!